Hey, welcome to Taylor Talk Season 5, Episode 3. This is a special Sunday edition. Why you're saying Sunday edition? Well, you know, there's no school on Monday, Labor Day, so I just wanted to make sure everybody was aware of that. Uh, we don't want anyone showing up at 7 o'clock wondering where everybody is in Car Rider Line. It would be a great experience to zip through there so quickly. I know that, but uh, there is no school, so don't plan on being here on campus on Monday. All right? Oh, some good news. Our FSA for math and science scores have come in. Uh, they came in on Friday. Friday, we actually gave those test scores to the students who attended last year. It's only scores for students who attended here last year, fourth grade and up. So those scores have come home uh, on Friday. So ask your student to be on the lookout for that in their book bags and in their backpacks. Um, those scores have come in. And again, it's for math and science only. ELA still has not come in. When it does, we will certainly be sending those home for you. Reminder that car line closes at 3.20 every day. So from 3.20 to 3.30 is sort of that window of which we're finalizing the Outback stuff. So if you come in between 3.20 and 3.30, we're gonna ask you to park in a parking spot or parallel park around the front by the garden. We're gonna grab your permit from you. And then at 3.30, we're gonna begin getting those kids out for you. So you can, we'll take your permit and then you can sit in your car in the AC for a little bit. Then at 3.30, pop out of your car, come on up front and then we will start getting those students to you uh, so that you can get out of there as quick as possible. Just a reminder that, again, there is no school on Monday. We want to make sure everybody is familiar and, and knows that they don't have to get up early for that. And then uh, just some heads up for you. The apartment complex out back and the storage unit uh, company out back as well, they are experiencing a high volume of people who don't belong parking in their parking lots, and they're getting a bit frustrated about that. So wanted you to know um, that is not considered our property and those are not parking areas for you to use uh, during uh, drop off and pick up for students. Um, there has been discussion about having parents ticketed for being in those areas. And then of course they always reserve the option to tow as well. So you don't wanna get involved with that. Uh, we can't protect you over here from that. It is something that uh, is private property, part of the apartment complex and part of the storage complex. So try to be as respectful of that as you can as you're making decisions about drop off and pick up in the mornings and afternoons. All right, and if you miss club and intramural night on uh, Thursday night, it's not too late. You have until the 17th of September to pick your club. So if you were not able to attend or you have some more questions or you did attend and you decided, hey, I wanna change this and go to here or do this, it's not too late to do that. You have until September 17th to line up and get paid in order to be a part of that. It does a uh, uh, one day a week. Um, I believe most of them are meeting on Mondays, but some on Fridays for one hour. It does cost $52 for the semester to be a part of it. And then second semester, there will be a new set of clubs and things to do as well. Well, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic Labor Day. You deserve the rest. It's been a tough start. I know COVID has made everything very challenging, but it's going to get better day by day. I can promise you that. It's a great day for learning. Renaissance Charter at Crown Point. We are Point. We are proud. Have a fantastic weekend.